Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to revert or get the classic Microsoft Paint back on your Windows 11 computer. So if you don't like the new Paint app or you don't like Paint 3D on your Windows 11 computer, um, in today's tutorial I'm going to show you guys how to go get the classic Windows 7 era version. So it was around in Windows 10 as well, and even in early preview and developer builds of Windows 11. However, it's, you can see it has been removed from the later versions of Windows 11's beta and into the final release. So in today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to go about downloading the Classic Paint application. So it should be a pretty straightforward process. And without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right into it. So all you have to do is open up a web browser of your choice. It's going to be a very easy and simple process here, guys. So I'm going to have a link in the description of the video to a free application here. It's win7games.com. And it's just classic paint. And you can see that it's an app that does not include the paint 3D button and promotion. And it's even more, I mean, I guess you could say valuable in Windows 11 now that they have removed the classic paint altogether. So I'm going to show you guys how to go about just downloading it at this point. So pretty easy. I'm just going to go ahead and download the compressed folder, which is how it comes from the website. And then double click on the setup file once it launches in Windows Explorer here to actually launch the application. Just because it says Classic Paint for Windows 10, don't worry about it. It will work for Windows 11 as well. If you receive a user account control prompt, select Yes. And you can close out of your applications this time. It says Welcome to the Classic Paint Setup Wizard. This will install Classic Paint on your computer. It's recommended that you close all other applications before continuing. Click Next to continue or cancel to exit setup. Go ahead and select Next. And we will create a desktop icon just so we can launch it after it's done. And we're going to create it for all users. If you want to just do it for the current user, you do have that option here as well. Select Next to proceed. It will show you the destination location as well as any additional task here. You don't really have to be too bothered with any of this. It's all automated. So go ahead and select Install. And give it a moment here. And once it's done, I'm going to uncheck the option to visit WinArrow. I believe those are the developers of it. However, this file is hosted on the site that I have in the description. And when you go on the WinArrow page, they link to this page, actually. So I'm pretty sure that this is where they would link you to download it anyway. But anyway, go ahead and check Mark versus Run Classic Paint. Select Finish. And give it a second here. And there you go. You have Classic Paint reinstalled on Windows 11. So pretty straightforward process, guys. And you can see it should work just like the classic paint application. And if you open up search and you search for paint, you see it says apps. You don't select the paint app. You want to select paint classic. So just keep that in mind in the future. I'm sure there's a way that you could change the shortcut just to say paint and even hide this other paint app or maybe even uninstall it. But that's a video for another day, guys. But you can see it under apps. So maybe you do want to have the other paint too. So now you have two paint applications. But Actually, it might let you uninstall the other one, which you're welcome to try if it lets you. But anyway, go ahead and open up Paint Classic here. And there you go. And if we file Save As, just to give you an example, so if we save it to the desktop, for example, it should work just fine. So pretty straightforward process. I do hope I was able to help you out, and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.